Hello, Father James Kubicki here, and I suspect that even if you weren't around when the Mass was celebrated in Latin, you've heard the words, Tantum Ergo. That's the title of a song that today's saint wrote, and it's often sung in Latin or in English at benediction and other Eucharistic devotions. Its author is St. Thomas Aquinas, who was commissioned by the Pope himself in the 13th century to compose hymns that would renew people's faith in the real presence of Jesus in the Blessed Sacrament. That's just as important for us today. In fact, Pope John Paul II wanted the Church to have what he called a sense of Eucharistic amazement. In other words, if we really believed what the Church teaches about Christ's presence in the Holy Eucharist, we would all have one overwhelming feeling, amazement. Amazement that Jesus loved us so much that he transforms bread and wine into his body and blood so that in receiving Holy Communion, we are united to him. One way you can grow in your faith in Jesus' presence in the Eucharist is through the practice of spiritual communions. At any time during the day, you can pause, recollect your thoughts, and express your desire to receive Jesus. Let's do that now. Lord Jesus, I believe that you are present in the Eucharist and that when I receive Holy Communion, I am receiving you, your body and blood, your soul and divinity. I cannot receive you now, but I pray that you come to me spiritually with all the graces I need never to be separated from you by sin. Come to me spiritually so that I may always live in union with you and be a reflection of you to all the people who will see me this day. Amen. <laughs>